Hey besties, so what I'm gonna be doing today is using my Glowforge Aura to make a journal. You can of course make any other kind of book, but that's what I'm going to make. This tells you what you need and it tells you about how long it's gonna take. I'm gonna press open my design and remove that first piece altogether. I'm going to go ahead and copy and then paste another side of this piece. So basically it's blank. I am going to go ahead and place my logos so that I can do my design. So the logo for my front cover is going to be about 3.5 inches and the logo for my bookmark will be about 1.5 inches. I'm going to add in an outline. It's going to be about 0.12 of an inch and then I'm going to add in a small circle at the top of my bookmark that's going to allow me to place my jump ring so that it can hang. I'm going to do a sample with you guys. This is going to be with a folded sheet of copy paper. I'm going to actually be using a thicker 65 pound cardstock for my journal. Since I'm using 8.5, I want to pull my peg five that you see right here. So for right now, I'm gonna push it in. Make sure they're all in. So it is folded in half. You could do, I believe, like 20 sheets at one time for like standard copy paper. So I press once. Okay, and slide this all the way out, and then you pull your paper all the way to the edge. You pull peg five, and then press again. Basically to cinch it, you're going to use this uh, back part of the machine and what, depending on how big you want your binder to be, that's how you're going to, how, how big you want to buy it. Like this one is one inch, so it fits a good amount of paper on this one. The one that I'm doing in the video is five eighths, so you just push this down, just like it says here, push and turn, so you're going to turn until you get to five eighths simple and then you just place it here and press down okay. okay so that's a pretty good side so I hook mine here and then that way you can just pull it down that way wherever your page is okay so I like to place it there just to see how long I want it so I think right about right there is good
Okay, so this is the end result. I did some pens as well, just so you guys can see what that would look like. They take about three minutes for about three inches of space. Uh, here is the bookmark. These take about two minutes to do. The cover took about, I want to say about 40 minutes to engrave the logo on there. This is one that I also did with acrylic, just so you can see what that looks like. And then you can, of course, you know, you're in a business meeting or whatever. And of course, these could be custom pages. This will hold your space like that. Again, really good gift for anybody in a professional capacity, uh, you know, holidays, men's gifts, things like that. So if you guys have any questions, please let me know down below in the comments. I thank you as always for watching and I'll see you on the next video.